Hello everyone and welcome back to Sketch by Sketch. Today we're going to be flipping through all of my 25 drawings of Christmas drawings. I have them all here. So let's get right into it. By the way, if these aren't in order, sorry, they just were in a stack on my desk. But here we go with day two. If you want to see day one, it's on my Pinterest. So I just didn't have it with me right now, but I just drew festive. thought that turned out really cute. Here we have day three, which is snow globe. This one wasn't my favorite, but I really liked the idea, and I honestly wouldn't mind drawing it again sometime. I just didn't like the actual um, pose, maybe. Just something was off about it. Here we have day four, which is cookies. I've drawn this before, actually, just not on the channel. Um, the similar drawing, at least. And I think it turned out really adorable. I love the idea, and I just think the whole thing is very pretty. I think this one is adorable. The word was shopping for day five. Um, I think this girl really looks like um, Romy Stride. I hope I pronounced that right. But her face just looks like her and I think it's really adorable. Here was tinsel. I used some gold metallic paint on this and I didn't color it in. I just used that and I think that it really made the gold pop by not coloring the rest of it in. And I like the way that one turned out a lot. The face is really cute. This one, I just did some line art for snowman. Uh, the legs are not proportional to the body, but it still is a cute drawing, and I think the bow on the snowman is really adorable. Here we have a bow. I just drew a girl with some bows on her dress and in her hair, and I really tried to blend out those colors with my markers, and um, I usually don't spend that much time on that, but I thought it turned out cute. This one is my favorite, I think. Uh, the word was gingerbread cookie, and I just love the colors. It's a little bit desaturated, but it's still just super cute, and I actually love that one. Next one is candy cane, day 10. I drew a girl with some candy cane swirled hair and a skirt, and I just really like the colors, and I just really like that drawing. Here I just decided to get rid of the prompt word for the day because I wasn't feeling it and I drew Elsa. Um, I'm not actually a big fan of Frozen but for some reason I just wanted to draw her and she is Christmas winter related so that's what I did on that day. Here I drew an elf which because of her hairstyle you can't see her pointy ears but you can see by the outfit she looks like an elf so she turned out adorable. Here the word was gloves, so I just drew a girl with some mittens on, nothing too special. Next day was mistletoe, I drew Ariel and Prince Eric, I do believe, um, and I think that one is super pretty. I used some colored pencils with my hoo hoo brush markers, and I love the way that that turned out with both mediums used together. This I would love to go back and finish coloring. The word was bell as in like ringing a bell, but I went ahead and changed it to bell as in the princess because I wanted to draw her in her winter outfit. This one is really pretty, I think. I wish I would have colored it and I might go back and do that, but I'm gonna put in a clip here of what this makes me think of. And if it made you think of that too, then leave me a comment down below. You'll think it's funny, I'm sure. I'm in a store and I'm singing. I'm in a store and I'm singing. Hey! There's no singing in the North Pole. All right, now that we've all had a good laugh, moving on to the next drawing. Uh, this one is actually another one of my favorites. I think she's really cute. Um, beside the fact that her being blonde, it actually kind of looks like me. I think it's really adorable. I'm just hanging an ornament on the Christmas tree and I love the box of decorations in the background. This one is really adorable. I did a video on it, actually. The word was reindeer, and I actually made some Christmas cards out of these. Um, so please check out that video. It was super fun to do. Next was Christmas decorations. So I just drew a girl holding a big box of decorations because you all know that it's just a mess when you're trying to decorate the house for Christmas, and you all have that big box of decorations. So that's what I decided to draw. Next we have presents. Um, I think this one turned out really nice with the colors that I chose. Um, I love how all the packages match each other, but they all have a different design. Mm -hmm. 
here I decided to try something different and use some watercolors. The word was tree, so I drew a girl sitting on the floor right beside the Christmas tree with the stockings in the background. Um, I like the idea, but the watercolors actually aren't my favorite, and I didn't do them again during this challenge. Here the day was day 22, and the word was wreath. So I drew a wreath for more of the background, and then just drew a girl and colored her in. So that one's a little more simple, but I still like it. This one I think was super pretty. This was a girl holding a strand of lights. I used a little bit of markers, but mostly colored pencils. And I think that the really light color scheme with the bright lights looks really cool. Here we were um, not having as much time to finish these drawings because it was Christmas, like Christmas Eve and Christmas Day, so I didn't have time to really finish them. Um, actually, Christmas Day there wasn't a drawing. I don't know why I called this 25 Drawings of Christmas because there was only 24, but I really hope you guys enjoyed them. I know I had a lot of fun doing it. If you guys did it, let me know and maybe tag me um, at Pinterest and show me your drawings. Thanks so much for watching, and I'll see you guys in another video. Goodbye!